is Ardelli here with your online nightly newscast for Monday, December 14th. These are our top stories posted on WPRI.com tonight. We have breaking news from the State House. Just a short time ago, Governor Don Kachiri's administration detailed plans to close a mid year budget deficit that now stands at almost $220 million. According to a copy of the briefing obtained by Eyewitness News, the new supplemental budget includes a $125 million reduction in aid to local cities and towns. And now a story we brought you first on WPRI.com. Only Eyewitness News cameras were there when Cumberland and Attleboro police arrested 25-year-old Liam Lambert of Gloucester this morning. Police say the man stole a pickup in Cumberland, and when police caught up to him, he sped off. They caught him after he drove the pickup into a wooded area, then jumped out and tried to run. Detectives are trying to determine if he's linked to other crimes. Middletown police are searching for a callous thief accused of stealing more than $17,000 worth of materials from the St. Columbus Cemetery. Investigators say the suspect took 39 metal vases from the cemetery on Browns Lane. Four of the vases are valued at $100 apiece, and the 35 others are valued at $500 apiece. Please call police with any information on the theft. New details now on a school evacuation. Dozens of children are taken to the hospital following a natural gas leak at a Boston charter school. And we now know it was a maintenance worker who accidentally opened up a gas line while working on the school's heating system. As a result, gas fumes were sucked into the ventilation system of the Excel Academy Charter School. And when teachers noticed the gas smell, the entire building was evacuated. That's when many children began complaining of headaches, nausea, and dizziness. Some students were given oxygen at the scene, and 34 kids were taken to the hospital as a precaution. Fortunately, no one was seriously injured. The school has about 200 children from grades 5 through 8. And for all of your up-to-the-minute online nightly news, stay with WPRI.com. Thanks for watching.